Now we're dealing with an array three post order traversal. And it's very similar to the previous one we just did. In the previous lead code question, we were dealing with free order traversal. So now I have the roots of a tree. You can have an unlimited amount of child nodes. It's not a binary tree, just like in the previous question. And we need to return the values of the nodes in the tree using the post order traversal, but we need to return the values in a vector of integers. Just like in the previous lead code problem, every node has a vector containing pointers to its child nodes. So if we want to solve this challenge, it's very simple. First, we can have this private access modifier and create a vector of integers belonging to the solution class. Now I need to check if I have a valid node and if that node has child nodes, meaning that the size of the vector called children is above zero, because remember here that every node has this vector, children. So if that vector has a size above zero, definitely it means that this node is not null. Then I can iterate through that vector access every child node, and at every iteration, I'm going to run my post order algorithm. So post order is this function. You can see that here we are using recursion. And when we are done with this part, we need to look at this condition here. Imagine that the node was a leaf node, meaning that it has no child nodes. So we don't need to visit any child nodes for this current node. It means that none of this is going to run because this condition here uses the end operator. So we'll jump here directly. And if it was a leaf node, then this will evaluate to true, meaning that we're going to add that node's value directly inside of the vector. So if none of this run, then this is going to run. When we are done, we can return the values, which is this vector here, storing all the node's values from our tree. So now let's submit this directly because it's very similar to the previous challenge and we've passed all the test cases. So that's it. It was very simple. I hope you enjoyed it. If you like this solution and you like my lead code videos, please subscribe and I'll catch you next time.